Definitely reacting to excitement and when fish are being caught. Hear those uh, shouts there, there's a, a catch being made yeah. just now. Look at that, fantastic. Right on cue. <laughs> Working on the boat, obviously, it's, it's quite hard work. Commercial fishing, that's quite a physically demanding role, you know. With uh, sport fishing boats and passenger boats like what we've got here now, obviously it's being in tune with the customers. Obviously you've got to be punctual and reliable. That's the key ingredient. You always want your deck hand, your deck mate. If you if the boat's gonna go, they need to be there with you, otherwise the boat can't go. A passion for angling or a, a you know an interest in fishing. It's obviously working on a fishing boat. They need to enjoy what they're doing. Because otherwise it can be torture, can't it? You know, when you're being rocked around and rain and wind you know it's <laughs> unless you love it yeah. it's pain pure pain and you can normally pick it up from people whether they've got that sort of uh, fishing bug if you like you know or interest that's half the battle isn't it if they're interested in what they're doing and enjoy it then the whole thing works doesn't it so we we need up to 40 staff for the operation in the season and then we bring it back to about 15 for the winter because the boats then as soon as the season finishes at the end of October we run all year but the main you know the main part of the season finishes then we go into refit mode so by the time you get to March you know the, hopefully the last boat sliding down the slipway ready for action and off we go again they work operationally throughout the season on board there's, there's roles on the shore as well, sales roles, you know, and office roles, and we sort of bring that up, and the cafe there as well, you know. The end of the season, we sort of pick the best, you know, that have performed at the end of the day. You know, you could have been here for, I am loyal, but I'm looking for the ones that have performed that season, you know, especially the youngsters, and I think the prospects are there, but it's hard work, but the rewards are fantastic, you know. Well, I've never really, thought of it like that, like always enjoyed fishing and never really thought of like pursuing a career but actually being out there today is actually something I'll be quite interested in doing. I mean, I'm, like I say, I've always enjoyed fishing so sort of natural progression would be to try and find a career somewhere.